Listen to your preferred news feeds with Odiogo.com. Islam for UK, hate on our streets. An Islamic fascist group has organized a series of lectures across the Midlands where vile preachers of hate are espousing the violent doctrine of jihad. Islam for UK, an offshoot of the Ban al Muhajiron group, are conducting the lecture tour to spread the message of hate to young Muslims. The group, followers of exiled fanatic Omar Bakri Mohammed, recently caused outrage when they arranged a public meeting in the Midlands where posters advertising the event carried the message KUF are lost to be extinct. One such star of the Pratt Pack tour is Abu Walid, who has given speeches in Birmingham, Derby and Leicester. His rants are one of over 140 extremist speeches that have been put on YouTube by the Islam for UK group. In his lectures on YouTube, entitled Youth Sparks a Fire, Walid gives a chilling insight into the violent and hate-filled rhetoric being peddled on British streets by extremist Muslims. In one speech he ridicules the British intelligence services and says that they have vastly underestimated the number of members of the jihad movement in the UK. MI5 got it wrong when they said there is 2,000 so-called radicals within Britain and they all got trained in Afghanistan. Really? And you're supposed to be intelligence and you saw them all go there and come back? What are you going to do about it now? Walid then pours scorn on the government's attempts to tackle the problem of him and his ilk. They say Muslim groups will be given £70 million to help tackle extremism in ungoverned places. What are ungoverned places? Internet chat rooms, snooker halls, youth centers? As if there's going to be someone from Al-Qaeda saying, Ivy got a couple of rucksacks there in the back, do you want one, what size are you? Obviously not. He also called on his listeners to reject the laws of Britain and chastised other Muslim groups for handing terror suspects to the police, telling his audience to stand with your brothers no matter what they had done. Salid was quite candid about his intention of bringing Islamic rule to Britain, the government knows we are a threat because they've studied our history. The British, they always have this strategy of rule and divide. But we the Shabab youth will wake up here in the West and we will bring the Sharia here to the UK. Birmingham City Council has recently earmarked £3 million to try and tackle extremism in local Muslim youth. Salid mocked this piece of appeasement, saying, this just goes to show how desperate these kafar are. Abu Walid is not the only hate peddler on Islam for UK's tour. Another of their speakers, Abu Uzair, gave this message to the people of Britain, we don't live in peace with you anymore. The banner has risen for jihad inside the UK, which means it's allowed for bombers to attack. <laughs>